Until you live or do business near a dump site, you may not understand the plight of residents where dump sites are located as they have to inhale very offensive smell day in, day out. As you're about to find out in this report, residents of Okofili, Igondo area of Lagos, where one of the dump sites in Lagos is located, say their lives remain in danger as long as that dump site remains at that spot and also is being poorly managed by the Lagos state government. Yes, it's a road. Top of my road. Yes. Order from dump sites transfer loading stations and recycling facilities and its attendant health implication has over the years been a source of concern to nearby communities. In Lagos, for instance, due to the rapid rate at which the city is growing, some dump sites which were initially located outside the city now appear within the domain of the city with their associated hazards which include surface and groundwater contamination bad smell and release of greenhouse gases. You can see our treating machine there. We used to back, backwash the water, treat the water for several times. We've spent a lot of money. We're still not yet, you know, getting clean water. So that is why we want to drill another borehole. The water, I think it contains iron. And the, the expert told us, so the, 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 the Experts in that field told us because of the dump sites around here, it's affecting the water. The residents around this place, in fact, their life is at stake because the odor coming out from this thing is very bad. And we can see that in any environment that is not clean, the disease outbreak is very high. We are talking about uh, COVID-19. The epidemic that we have been facing here is more than COVID-19, over 16 years. All the water within this very community is bad. We cannot be able to have drinking water anymore. Are you getting my point? Because the gasoline on this very axis of the thing is giving us a very big problem. Residents of Igondo community, where one of the dump sites in Lagos is located, say in addition to the traffic congestion created on the roads by the waste trucks, their water and indeed their entire life quality has been compromised by the dump sites. Uh, I must tell you the truth that we are not too comfortable here because the odor has been so bad and uh, it can't help the head. It's not good for the head of the people in this facility. In fact, this morning when I was passing by, I was thinking for opportunity of seeing at least making a broadcast that the, the government and the Lagos State government should be able to come to the rescue. If I dump your refuse, if you water the whole place, it's already filled up. So the order cannot allow the people living in this area to have a, a, good, a very good a health environment. General Hospital is very close to us here. Patients are in there. And we are in ailing death. Day in, day out, every blessed day. And government is not doing anything towards it. They said some people are sick and they are in there. When you hear the order during the rainy season, in fact, you have to lock up the old window of the houses. Let them come and find a solution to this very site. I'm telling you, my brother, I'm drilling now for the second time just because of the pollution of this very dumping site. To the residents and other concerned Nigerians, there could be a safe and cost-effective solution to the noxious odor and emissions produced by the dump sites which the government is yet to explore. They should be dump inside, not on the road. They are dumping on the road and most of their machines are faulty. As we get to the old auto, I think they should get chemicals. They should ask from people abroad how they manage it. They can get chemicals, you know. But if, the, if you say they should burn, the waste and the uh, smoke will still disturb the environment. But there are some chemicals that can, you know, keep um, destroy it. So we, we are pleading with the government to look for this. The solution is already here. There's a company in this Lagos that is producing an uh, odor killer. So we'll, I, I would advise the, uh, the government of this state, Lagos state, to look for the company. In short, I would advise the, the federal government to look for the company so as to cure this problem of what odors. 
efforts to speak with the state's waste management authority on what could be done to cut down on the offensive smell and also manage the dump size better have been unsuccessful.